Hey guys, uh, Daniel here, demoing another synthesizer for the Norns I worked on during the weekends. This is a bit different than the previous one I made. In the sense it's more pad oriented. It's called 13 Angels. And what it is basically is a delay vowel synth. So a vowel synth is just synthesizer that produces vowels. It has a delay. I will just demo it because it's quite difficult to explain otherwise. Lovely pixel art as always. And you can see that there is a left angel and a right angel. Originally there were supposed to be 13 angels, but yeah, I'm lazy. So let's just, you know, make a sound. So what just happened here is that the left angel produced an R and the right angel produced an E and the delay between those was 0 0.3 seconds. Uh, it says deal wide line instead of delay because we are dealing with music synthesizers here and uh, you're not allowed to actually write the full name of parameters even if you have the space for it. It's a known uh, rule in sound engineering. Right, so what vowels are playing? Currently it's on random. Both of the angels are playing random vowels, but K2 changes the vowel for the left angel and K3 for the right angel. So you can see if I put here, uh, let's see, an A. Ah. And ooh, we get an a uh, ooh. And all of the encoders control the delay because there are no other parameters. So I decided to make life easy for everyone. We get nice animations of the engines talking to each other which is very useful. Um, and you get the captain log, everything that the angels have said is written on the background. Now, there are some limitations to it. I must say that writing this was not a piece of cake and the synthesizer engine itself, the Super Collider code, involves just so much stuff. Uh, I based it off some scenes definition that I found online that was not written by the person who posted it. He credited someone, but the link was broken. So if you are the person who wrote the original code and you can recognize some parts of it, ping me. I will make sure you get all of the credit. So what are some of the limitations I mentioned? Uh, first of all, because it is quite a heavy synth, you can only play two sounds at a time, so... That's perfectly fine. Let's change the delay to 0. Point something reasonable again, 0. 0.2, let's say. Yeah, so... That works just great, but... You can see that the third note is already not doing anything. Uh, that's by design, because what happens if you have too many notes playing? It's, it starts making those crippling sounds, and I still didn't figure out exactly what is the issue, but there is something like 16 oscillators. I think there are maybe 32 filters or something stupid like that per sound and we are making two sounds uh, every note so it's not exactly uh, light so you can you can basically see what will happen like if, if you want to make your life difficult set the delay to like one seconds and press a lot of random buttons and you will get crickling sounds, uh, like noise warning. <laughs> mm, 
Yeah, I mean, it's not the worst thing that can happen, but I preferred to keep it simple and keep it at two notes, limit at a time. Um, right, so the name actually, 13 Angels, uh, it's because I was inspired a lot by the sounds of 13 angels standing around your bed by a silver mount Zion. There is this very lovely ow sound going throughout the track and it's very emotional and I was thinking, man, it would be great to have something like that with a bit more uh, control, modulation, etc. Uh, so I spent my entire weekend making this. And... You can... Right. Now, an interesting mode here, that, uh, worth mentioning, is the random vowel. Uh, it's great if you're making ambient music and you're not really sure what are you going for. It seems to be the most typical use case for the Nords. Uh, so now, every time I press a button, I will get two random vowels. And that's basically everything that it does. Um, it's not the most useful synth, I'll be the first one to admit, but it's a lot of fun, so go have at it, have some fun. <laughs>